Hello, hello, you have reached Mystic Mohawk, and I'm coming to you today with a Divine Masculine read. So we want to know what's been Divine Masculine's energy field. So we have the Divine Masculine being an Emperor in reverse mode. And when an Emperor is in reverse, this Emperor tends, tends to lack motivation, lack maturity, lack self-control. He can also be a pushy, domineering kind of an Emperor that is currently or will be in the near future having a loss of prestige and social status. We also have the Magician, and the Magician is here, and it also comes in reverse. And this Magician in the reverse could represent a man, a self, a selfish, and a selfish manipulator that can have a selfish, relentless pursuit of money, power, or materialistic gain. He also may deceive others, but we not deceive others with magic, but we're not talking about the kind of spell magic or anything like that. We're talking about the magic of the wand, you know, the magic stick. We're talking about that spell magic. We're talking about this defined masculine being a mobile semen engineer. And let me tell you what a mobile semen engineer is. Mobile semen engineer is one that likes to use the term pump and dump. And when you pump and dump, you pump, dump, pump, dump, pump, dump, pump, dump. You just go from body to body. You ain't nothing. You ain't nothing. This masculine is has a porta potty body. Let me tell you what a porta potty body is. A porta potty body is anybody can have it, anybody can get it. It's community genitalia. Okay, so moving right along, moving right along. We also have the three of wands, and the three of wands represents no clarity, bad advice given, and bad advice taken. Also represents rejection. And making hasty decisions. So, hmm, we are talking about the divine masculine. We are talking about one that may have be a captain of the Quam Skull. So let me tell you what a captain of a Quam Skull is. He is one that don't care about females. He is always in night energy that is to get in and get out. Okay. So. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, can you tell us and give us some clarity on this divine masculine that likes to, uh, that likes to, that's, to give us some Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, can you please give us some clarity on this divine masculine who is the captain of the cum squad? We would like to know about him that likes to pump and dump, pump and dump. Pump and dump. We would like some clarity about this divine masculine. Holy Spirit, Holy Angel. We would like to know, okay? Y'all want to know a whole lot of things. Mm. Okay, so we have... This one came out first. And that was Toxic Family. And then Purity. And then guarded. Okay, so we see that our divine masculine is involved with someone that's in a toxic family. And he feels like their toxicity has ran off on him. And he needs to purify himself. Oh, okay. And whoever this female is, she feel like the relationship, she now feel like she has to walk. She has to stalk. She has to be knee-high private eye. She has to watch this man's every move. Okay, so Holy Spirit, give us a little bit more clarity about divine, damn, divine masculine, you wants to talk. So, we have Christmas here, we have a new view, we have addictions, and we have desire. So, we know who this desire for, this desire is for divine feminine. 
So, Divine Feminine, your masculine, we already know he has addictions, and this came in the reverse. He also is seeing a new view of you, honey doo doo. So, what happened on Christmas? He's still in the Saji entity about how you put that thing down. Okay. <laughs> okay. So, tell me about this Divine Masculine and his, uh, Pump and dump. Pump and dump. Pump and dump. Pump and dump. And why he still wants to lay off his bad spirits off on this feminine. So, we have lying. He's still lying. So, divine feminine. He's still lying. He's still cheating. He's probably still in a third party himself. So, everything that the masculine comes to tell you, it's pure lies. It came in the reverse. He's a liar and his feet stink and he don't love Jesus. Okay. So, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, can you tell me a little bit more about this lying? Ooh, that wanted to fall out. So, mm. situations need to have more violence. This violence and lying, just know, Divine Feminine, you have one up on him. He's lying and now you know. I know, you know, we know, you lie. Own up to your bullshit. It's about that time. Damn, don't you look foolish. Cause you know, I know, you know, you lie. And now that my feminine knows that you lie. Hey, so tell me a little bit more about this balance and this lying. What is the bi masculine lying about? Okay, these wanted to fall out. Okay, so he's been lying to himself about someone that he catfish. And that person that he catfish is a very childish energy. She doesn't take anything seriously, and she's also a muse. So you ask for that shit, divine masculine. Tell me more about this muse and how the masculine feel about this. Mm. Mm. We have missing peace and romantic thoughts. So, Divine Mask, Divine Feminine, we know that these two cards represent you. He is having romantic thoughts of you, and he's also saying you are the missing piece of this life. But however, he cannot come to you, he cannot approach you, because he know he have skeletons in his closets. Look at all these rumors around me every day. That's what's playing in my head. Need something strong to make them go away. Look at all these skeletons. Can't take it no more. Look up my light. Put on the light and see the floor go. Girl. Skeletons. So there's a whole lot of skeletons in this boy's closet. That he don't want you to know about. Girly. So, you know now about the boy having, ooh, 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 ooh. So, he wants an apology for New Year's. You stood him up? Yeah, we want to know about this apology in New Year's. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, give us some clarity on this New Year's. Hey, give us some clarity. On this New Year's, honey. Yes. So give us some clarity on this New Year's. Hidden truth about New Year's. Let's see what at the bottom of the deck. Oh, there's a hidden truth for the New Year's. It's not hitting no more. Grass was not greener on the other side. And now he know that you know. And he has submerged feelings about it. Mm. Okay. So tell me a little bit about these Submerged feelings. Tell me a little bit about these submerged feelings. What are these feelings that Divine Masculine is feeling? Oh, God. So these is turned over. These four cards. One, two, three. And I shuffled and all four of these cards is turned over. So we about to get them. So... We have wavering. 
in the reverse, we had the tower has fallen. Misery loves company. Barricade. And suicidal outcast, like I said before. So, we have divine masculine. Hmm. Then we have divine feminine that has put up her wall because she's saying misery loves company and she don't want to be bothered with your ass. And now divine masculine now feels that the tower has failed because divine feminine don't want him. So now he's in a wavering, stuck feeling of what what I could, what should I did, what could I did. Oh, let me tell you what you could have did. You couldn't have cheated. You couldn't have had a third party. You couldn't have put people before Divine Feminine and her kids. You sat there. You ignored her calls. You ignored her. You act like you didn't know what her value was. And you put third parties before her. That was the issue. And now she don't want to be bothered. Clarify. We would like to clarify this social outcast. How has Divine Masculine been social outcast? How has the captain of the cum squad been okay? So these two want to fall. So we have the I and I for an I taken for granted. So we have divine feminine here that feels like she has been taken for granted. Now divine feminine feels divine masculine feels like divine feminine has did something to her. He has now hurt her feelings. No, uh-uh. It's called karma and now the tables have turned and we have turned our back on you. That's what that's called. So, we have Divine Feminine, again, taken for granted. Now she also feel an eye for an eye. Person, you are receiving your karma. Please keep that bad news over there. Please nobody give me no bad news. 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 Please nobody give me. Don't nobody give me. Please nobody give me. No bad news. That's what she's saying. Keep that drama. Keep those problems. Keep all those things over there. And we would like to get some clarity on this I for I. Mm hmm How does divine feel about this divine feminine feel about this I for an I? Okay. How she feel about this I for I? What the hell? Gloom and doom came to the reverse. So our divine feminine does not care how you feel. She don't give a motherfucker. She don't give a fuck. Just to say it just as slowly as I can. She don't. She chopped and screwed. She said, She don't give up. You know how they chop and screw? She chopped and screwed it on that ass. She said, You are now living in gloom and doom in your karma. Please keep that bad luck hiddenness over there. Have a good day. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good day. So, Speaking of having a good day, let's find out. We want to know. How is your day going, Divine Masculine? Since you're in gloom and zoom, gloom and doom, tell us how you're feeling about this gloom and doom. We want to know about this gloom and doom. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, can you please give us the answers about this gloom and this doom? How Divine feeling? What is his, what is his, uh, mind state. How is he feeling right now? What does this gloom and doom mean? What does this gloom and doom mean? Mm, these three wanted to come out. Bad traits, control, and cheating. So Divine Feminine says the reason why she does not want to be bothered with your mess anymore and she's not wishing gloom and doom on you but this is what you did to her you cheated on her you tried to control her and your bad traits is what sent her packing these boots are made for walking and that's just what they'll do 
One of these days, these boots are gonna walk all over you. Your bad traits and what you was doing, your actions pushed her away. Clarify these bad traits, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Clarify these bad traits. We would like to know a little more about these bad traits. Oh, I can tell you some bad traits. Ow. Dinner with mattress backs. That's a bad trait that you have. Mmm. What's another mattress back? Another uh, a bad trait. You betray people. You give people cups of hopium. Having people thinking that you are a, a single person and you're not. And you're in full relationships with people. That's another bad trait that you have, Divine Masculine. Okay, so clarify these bad traits. And you're a liar, 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 liar. Red alert, liar. He's a liar. He's a liar. He's a MF and liar. He's a downright liar. He's a cap lock liar. Yeah. Push all the buttons. He's a cap lock liar. Okay. Tell me more about this lying. He's also a manipulator. Mm hmm He likes to use things to get what he wants from women. And he has no way of slowing down. He is the Terminator 5000. They don't die. They multiply. They just keep at it. And they keep on pumping dump. Pumping dump. Pumping dump. And being dick dealers everywhere. You get a turn. 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 Yes. That's what they want to do. But you're irresponsible masculine. And you need to know. Sex isn't wrong, but you got to be right. And if you're going to have sex, you better wrap it up tight. Listen, kids, because Mohawk ain't joking. Don't use protection and your dick will be smoking. Hmm. Hmm. Divine Masculine, why is you still, I'm getting, I'm, I'm getting that channeling right there. Why is you still not using condoms? Why are you still having sex with people without condoms on? You are a grown man. You are a grown man. And you still having sex with people without condoms on. My heart is racing. I'm getting hot and I have like a pain right there. Mm-hmm. Because I, I feel that divine masculine, divine masculine, I feel like Divine Masculine has caught another itchy, another episode of the Itchy and Scratchy Show. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. That's what I'm channeling. Because Divine Masculine don't know how to keep himself to himself. It's all these different women. It's all these different people. It's all these different things. I would like to get some clarity on this. I'm about to use my F Boy cards. Yeah, that's what I'm about to do. Let me move this on out the way. Let me move this on out the way. Mm, 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 mm. Mm, mm, mm. Mm, 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 mm. Divine masculine. Aren't you tired of the itchy and scratchy show? Aren't you tired of getting aren't you tired of getting them shots in your tail? Listen, let me tell you something. Miss Everest boys was not a choice for them to get STDs. It was the government that gave it to them. So why in 2021 will a grown man be still subjecting himself to STDs? Having, it do not feel that good, honey. To keep on having sex with people, girl, it do not feel that good. It is not worth your life. It. But if you learn how to pick your female and stop dealing with the Krabby Patties, you know, the Krabby Patties, the ones that can't keep their self to their self, the ones with the Jezebel spirit that have to have everybody that been for everybody, you know, them type of females, them, the mattress backs, you are a, you are the captain, the captain. Of the cum squad. You the captain of the cum. The captain of the cum squad don't know how to tell his uh his folks behind him how to act. 
he walking around having sex with people without condoms on? I really would like to know. You know what? I want to get a couple of these cars out about this guy that going. These is no fucks, no shits given. So since you don't give a shit, we don't give a shit about you. Since you don't give a shit about wearing condoms, we about to see what's going on with you. And your little problems that you... No, we're not going to do that. Okay, well, these are the first three, and they wanted to come out. So, forgiveness will hit. Ooh, that was more than three. So, divine feminine, divine masculine, you need to let shit go. That's what it's saying. Oh, you've been doing a whole lot of letting go with your pump and dump. You've been letting a whole lot of a whole lot of things go with your pump and dump. You've been letting a lot of things go with the pump and dump. You have not learned. We see your parents didn't teach you the sex songs about all the sexually transmitted disease. You didn't know that. You didn't know that we are the herpes. And that's a fact. We are the herpes, the good old herpes. They will be your best friend. They'll stay with you into the end. No cure for them in sight. They won't go out without a fight because they the herpes. The herpes! You know, those stay with you for life. When you, you know, you keep on doing those type of things. Then you have the chlamydia, the syphilis, all those things. Again! Stop us. Do not love your life. But let's get back to the cards. Rejuvenate and decide it's really worth in this for sa sacrificing your happiness and life for seriously. Divine masculine, all jokes aside, do you really think having sex is really that daggone important to you that it's worth your life? It do not feel that good. Or oh, divine feminine. Or oh, not divine feminine, comic. Or oh, anybody out here for that much. Out here, been a thotty, yaddy, yaddy. Is it that much? Is it that much that you would sell your body and do things and have sex with people without protection and put your life in danger for? It's not worth it. Divine masculine. Your body. Your body. It's like a porta potty. Everybody go in that thing. You go up in everybody. Bang, bang, bang. Do that thing. That's all you do. That's all you know how to do. You need to be a man. That is not all you worth. It's bang, bang, bang. Do that thing. You worth more than that than your body. Dang. You got more to offer than that. Male or female, you got more to offer to somebody than your body. Stop it with the banging. Stop it. Stop the bang, bang. Don't do that thing. Anyway, connect with your heart. It's missing the shit out of you. So all of these things that you are doing, the vibe masculine, you know that ain't you. I don't know who you been around, but whoever your friends is, they need to tell you to stop, drop, cut that shit out, masculine. Shut it down. Open, Don't open up the shop. Oh, oh, let that shit go. Stop, drop, don't let that shit down. Don't open up shop. Oh, oh, let that shit go. Let it go. That's not for you. That's not for you. All the women... Yeah, all the mobile, semen, engineer, ejaculations, that ain't for you, man. You need to get yourself together and stop it with all these sex things. And speaking of that, let's just, <sighs> my cause of Jesus, my cause of Jesus, my cause of Jesus. We are the herpes, the good old herpes. I'll be your best friend, I'll be with you in the end. No cure for me in sight. I won't go out without a fight because I'm the herpes. The herpes, they don't go anywhere. Stop having sex with people. And then you having sex with all these multiple people. I need you to stop. You're too old for that, man. Keep yourself to yourself. Like my mother, keep yourself to yourself. You can't be responsible with your body, divine masculine. Keep yourself to yourself. Don't nobody want none of them germs. Don't nobody want no nasty man's disease. We don't want that. We don't want no nasty women's disease. People don't want that. And divine feminine, she know you're nasty. She know you're nasty. She know you done got them shots in your tail. She know that. And she don't want that nasty. She like, keep, keep it over there. I don't want no parts of that. None. Keep your DD, dirty dick, keep that over there. 
We got a DD in the house. Hey, DD. DD. Keep on messing with all these Krabby Patties. These thought pockets. Damn, stay out the thought pocket, pussy. Damn. Got to keep telling you that you don't listen to people. All you want to do is pump and dump. Pump and dump done got him the itchy and scratchy show. The itchy and scratchy show. Yes, you are a member. You stay watching that, don't you? Okay, anyway. Can you tell us a little bit more about this pump and dump? Hold the spirit. Let us know about this pump and dump. Pump and dump. Pump and dump. Bang, bang, bang. Do that thing. Bang, bang, bang. Do that thing. Bang, bang, bang. Do that thing. That's all this is what we want to do is just bang, bang, bang. Damn. Oh. Okay. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, I'm getting off task with this banging. And we ain't talking about in Little Rock. Okay. We ain't talking about over there banging in Compton. We ain't talking about Compton. Compton. We talk about over here with Divine Masculine and these daggone things that he's doing. Please give us some clarity on these sex things. So, Divine Masculine has a lack of discipline. Mm, 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 mm. So, the, the comic says, so what? I do magic. It works for a minute to keep the masculine stuck. So I think this is why the masculine is having this in and out energy. He knows that these things are wrong. However, he knows that he do it because he's in this devilish energy that was put on him by these spells. Mm-mm. Divine Feminine said, go play video games, not with me. So Divine Feminine does not want to be bothered with this childish energy that Divine Masculine has been displaying. She don't want to deal with his cup of hopium that he's pouring out to all these females. She don't want to deal with that either. So tell me a little bit more about this uh, hopium that he giving for people. What is this hopium that he give up? Ooh, what is this hopium that he giving out to people? So... At the bottom of the deck, whoever is giving out this cup of hopium, it may be a Capricorn or someone with Capricorn in their chart. A earth sign. Mm, 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 mm. So Divine Masculine blames his whoredom on his childhood traumas. Which is a bunch of crap because everybody had issues and um you know with their family when they was little. But they didn't go up and say, I'm going to go fuck the world. That's not what you do. Divine masculine. To express yourself, it's just nasty and just downright. You need to grow up and keep your dick in your pants. And don't nobody want no dirty dick that's on fire anyway. Please, let that go. And why do you still want to keep on putting... Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, please let me stop. I do not want to tell this man about himself because I just don't. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, please give me another energy for Divine Masculine. So, we have, I didn't know I had sex with them both. How the hell you don't know you had sex with them both? Was you high? Was you high? Was you high? Now you running from your problems? See, this is why you need to stop having sex with a whole lot of people and stop getting drunk and do not go into your addictions because you will know what you did to people. Enabler. Mm, you're an enable. You keep things going by stepping in divine masculine. Hmm. You're an enabler. It also says, Divine Masculine, you are a shapeshifter. And what a shapeshifter is, a shapeshifter is one that acts accordingly around one to get their wants and needs, giving by being fake. <laughs> being fake. Tell us a little bit more about this shapeshifting. Tell us a little bit more about this shapeshifting. Mm, 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 mm. Oh, Divine Masculine, Divine Masculine, Divine Feminine say, don't start it. You do not want no smoke. She do not want to be bothered with you. So please stop it with all your I'm sorry, I'm um, this and that. When it was time for you to say you were sorry, you was out in the street and doing whatever. Now she do not want to hear nothing that you had to say. 
Pause. Pause. She don't want none of that. So keep it to yourself. Says Divine Feminine. I want no parts of this. I want no parts of your mind fuckery. I want no parts of your... What else does Divine Feminine say? Uh, Divine Feminine say, I'm calling you out on your bullshit. I know about it. So, all of those things that you were able to do to Divine Feminine in the past, you know, the lies, the mind trickery, the mind fuckery, it may have worked then, but it's not working now. It ain't working. Uh, and at the bottom of the deck, she says you're a hater. She says you also avoid eye contact when you're lying. She said in the past, she will go on tirades and say, why the masculine won't hit me back? So you ghost lighted her, you breadcrumbed her. So you was out there with your other females acting like you were so busy, but you just wasn't calling her back because you was entertaining or shall I say interviewing. You were uh, actively taking interviews from other uh, interviewees that put in applications. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. What else you got to say, Divine Feminine? What else you got to say? She, I'm guarded, so what? I'm guarded, so what? I obsess over you. I'm guarded, so what? I obsess over you. So what, Divine Masculine? You obsess over Divine Feminine. You need to stand your ass down and be obsessed with all the females, all the little, uh... The, all the little swalking chickens that you have to roost in the hen house, go be with them. Because uh, she don't want to be bothered. <clears throat> she don't want you. I invested so much in this Murray Me spell. Why isn't it working? Because you a dumbass. Calm it. Plain and simple. It's a dumbass. And why it didn't work? Because you are a cheap one. You went to the dollar store to go purchase your spells, you know? You didn't put your back into it. You didn't put anything into it. You just wanted the femi divine feminine out there. She not going nowhere because she's not you. How about that? How about that? So you can continue with your Dollar Tree, your Dollar General. You're not even Dollar Tree. Uh, your Dollar General spells because they aren't working, says divine feminine. Oh. This is what you do. You stalk. Mm. This is what you do. You stalk. You sit outside the Divine Masculine home to figure out if he would a woman. This is what you do. Women don't do this. Stalkers do this. You know, you keep it up. You're going to be on an episode of Snapped. Okay. And coming behind that karmic, you have mental discord. That needs to seek therapy. That is what I will do. You know, Psycho Susan, I would do that if I were you. Sitting outside of a man home and stalking him is wrong and is also a crime. Okay. Divine Masculine, you're hunted by what you did. You should be hunted. Because you see Divine Feminine is out here glowing up and she handling her business without you. Mm-hmm. She's handling her business without you. So tell me a little bit more about this uh divine feminine and her minding her business and her getting herself together. Mm-hmm. Tell me about this. Divine feminine said, please leave her alone. You MF and right, she's triggered. And you know why she's triggered? Because she's trying to move on with her life in this succubus, this Procalicia. Mm, and let me tell you what a Procalicia is. A Procula is a, a Procalicia. A Procalera is a man. And a Procalicia is a bitch that like to suck the fuck. Excuse my mouth. Like to suck the life out of you. And she's an energy vampire. So she is an energy vampire Procalicia. Look it up. Mm-hmm. Energy vampire. Look it up. Tell me a little bit more about this Procalicia. Mm -hmm. The Procalicia said, Procalicia, Procalicia said she been throwing, she been throwing paws on the masculine. She been putting them down. Girl, why is you fighting? 
She also says she took advantage of the masculine. We also have distorted female in the back. And and before that, we have masculine. You need to claim back your um your energy. You need to claim back your energy power. You need to claim back your power, masculine. You letting this female doing too much, but you doing too much with all these women. So your karma is coming back to you because you got a crazy bra that you can't get a, a get away from. But the one that you should have did everything for, that you should have been um in a relation to and been in a stable one, that one is the one that you want. And she don't want you because guess what? She have a book that she already read on your ass. She already know chapter... 13 of the bullshit. Divine Masculine is a cheater. Divine Masculine is a liar. Divine Masculine is a manipulator. So she already have your file and she don't want to read that book again. The book of the cheating uh, dick dealers. The book of the pump and dumps. The book of uh, the cum squad. The captain of the cum squad. Let me... um. Oh, we also know the book of the Itchy and Scratchy Show, the book of Too Many Krabby Patties, the book of Ben with Comics. Comic Comisha, one in particular. Mm-hmm, that one. We also know that that book of Community Genitalia, everybody done has some of that thing. You get a turn. No, you get a turn. No, I'll take a turn. No, she get a turn. Don't nobody want to be bothered with that. Anyway. 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 Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, can you please give us some crap? Girl, that's a Holy Angel. Uh, 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 oh, no. We can't do that. Mm-mm, no. We can't do that. Mm-mm, no. That's not going to be tolerated. Holy Spirit, Holy Angel. Can you please give us some some uh some clarity before we leave on divine masculine and how he's going to deal with these women, how he's going to deal with these STDs, how is he going to deal with this emotional and physical abuse, emotional, physical, and verbal attacks from this comic? Okay, divine masculine. Can you please see? This is why you're having a problem. I am asking how I am asking our divine. How are you going to get yourself out of this situation, right? And you not even paying attention to what our divine is saying. You sitting up here saying, "I miss that thing you do with your tongue." See, this is why you get in trouble. This, this right here is why you can't focus, man. This is why you always got your mind on getting your dick wet. <sighs> and at the bottom of the deck, we have hacking all in your business. So, we know divine feminine. This man wants to know, are you in a relationship with someone? Are you dating someone? What is really going on? And I'm not trying to be funny, but I'm getting real irritated by this. So, what I'm going to do is say, if you, no, I'm going to finish this out. Because I'm really tired of this divine masculine and all these women. Lord Jesus, what is going to Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, can you please give us the outcome on this divine masculine and why he can't get, he can't be a mature enough man to deal with people other than thinking about women and getting them in bed. Holy okay, so we have Yo, I can't stand divine masculine. I can't stand him. He is urgent. He said, faith, fate. This way was meant to happen. So it was meant for you to be a dick dealer. It was meant for you to be, to give, to sell people cups of hopium. 
It was meant for you to be a pump and dumper. It was meant for you to be the captain of the cum squad. That was meant to be. Anyway, if you like my vibe, like, skin, and subscribe.